In a way, makeup is like portraiture, with the artist setting out to create a flattering image of the subject by emphasizing the most attractive aspects of what DNA has provided. It takes an ability to see both what is and what can be. And it's a challenge that celebrity makeup artist Azra Baker relishes. Zaki met up with Azra for a private makeup, fashion and style masterclass. And we're about to see the results. Josie-based Azra Baker started off her career by qualifying and working as an educator until a newly discovered passion for makeup and style switched on her creative drive. Who doesn't love, love, love feeling beautiful and looking their best? I know I certainly do. I'm an insatiable learner when it comes to all things beauty, so when I came across Azra Baker, I had to get the inside info on this makeup artist and fashion lover who is completely self-taught. Mm -hmm. Come inside. Thank you. I made us some tea. Oh, what a treat. Can I pass you a cupcake? You do not have to ask me twice. Most welcome. Where does your story begin? Growing up, I was not the typical girly girl. I didn't enjoy makeup. I didn't enjoy dressing up. And after matric, I just got this random interest in hair, makeup, beauty, and I became obsessed. So my mom bought me a few staple items of makeup and I started playing around on my own face. And I actually realized that, wait, I enjoy this. You are completely self-taught. Everything has been learned from trial and error, experimenting, and literally just growing every day. What are the beauty trends you are most excited about this season? The first trend I've been noticing is the fluffy brow. Another thing I've also noticed is everyone's out with the full coverage foundation. So your blemishes and your imperfections are still slightly visible because we're in a time where we're promoting women feeling beautiful about themselves, accepting themselves for who they are. And I think that's such a beautiful trend. What is your best kept beauty secret? Investing in your skin and actually looking looking after your body because what you put in your body obviously reflects on the outside and if you have beautiful skin you can literally just pop on a lick of mascara and walk out of the house and look flawless. How is the face of beauty changing and why? The beauty industry is now so diverse. Everyone gets a say, everyone gets an opinion and we have different nationalities and races and cultures representing beauty and I think that's so beautiful that we promote the idea that whether you're thick, whether you're skinny, whether you're dark, whether you're light, whether you're short, it doesn't matter because there is a place for you in the world and you are beautiful. Azra, how have you created longevity for your brand? Providing a quality service, always making sure that my clients are happy and they receive the service they're paying for. And I think if you put passion into it, it can never fail. On the fashion side, as a petite person, I struggle with winter fashion because a lot of cuts and fabrics make me look very bulky and can be quite unflattering. Do you have advice for me in this field? Zikia, I'm going to show you how to look chic and sexy and beautiful in winter without looking like you've got a paper bag over you. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> So Zach, I know you're a lover of colour. Yellow is a really trending colour this season. So we've got you a cute little floral top. I'm going to pair this up with these pants over here to keep it fun. You could easily wear this with a boot, a sock boot or even a pointy heel. And the trick is layering in winter. And then another staple for winter is a great blazer. This could easily go with a pants, with a jean. If you want to be more sexy, a little mini skirt, a leather mini skirt with a pair of boots and I prefer the more neutral colour tones as opposed to the bright colours. Will you model one for me? Of course, Zach. Wow, earthy tones really do look beautiful on you. Thank you. What advice do you have for aspiring makeup artists out there? Work hard, stay true to your own style, stay true to what you know best, and never give up. Always push for your dreams. Azra, thank you so much for such a delightful day. You're welcome, Zach. It was such a pleasure having you. If you, like me, cannot get enough of beauty and fashion, Azra is definitely a young woman you want to be watching. Her taste resonates loudly, and she easily distinguishes herself from the pack.